Hey, what's up? I'm Wee Man. And I'm Steve-O. And we're on this week's episode of Truth or Dab. It's actually going down right now, pal. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, what's going on, everybody? For First We Feast, I'm Sean Evans, and welcome back to another exciting episode of Truth or Dab, the Hot One Special, where we give our guests two simple options, tell the truth or suffer the wrath of the last dab. And today, I'm excited to welcome Wee Man and Steve-O, two of the stars <laughs> of Jackass Forever. We should also shout out Steve-O's Wild Ride podcast, keep an eye out for tour dates coming to a city near you, and on an occasion like this, we've got to shout out Steve-O's hot sauce for your butthole, and then, he teased it on Hot Ones, and now it's finally here. The Butthole Destroyer, available on Amazon, stevo.com. Also, for those in the Southern California area, stop by Wee Man's Chronic Tacos, a delicious lunch pairing for today's episode, if ever there was one. Wee Man, Stevo, welcome to Truth or Dab. Always oh, good to thanks. see you, brother. Thanks for the love, too. And Wee Man, we're gonna start with you. Sure. So I'm sure that over the years, being on a show like Jackass, I suspect you've had all types of disagreements with industry overlords. What's the single specific worst note or piece of creative feedback you ever remember getting from a TV network or movie studio executive? The worst note or? I'm, I'm aware of a good one. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah? Yeah. Um, on Wild Boys, which was a show we did for MTV after the first Jackass movie, we routinely filmed something that was outrageously inappropriate to include in the first cut of the show. So that when it went to the standards and practices board, we could say, oh yeah, you know, we gave you that. <laughs> we called them red herrings. So when we were in Russia on the final Wild Boys trip, me and one other person who shall remain unnamed were wearing white, I believe, polar bear mascot suits with holes cut out in the nether region. And uh, activities were filmed. The note came back from the Standards and Practices Board saying, please remove the polar bear Wow. <laughs> yeah. And it actually segues rather poetically to my next question. I'm curious if there is a jackass segment that's buried in a vault somewhere because the folks at SMP just never wanted it to see the light of day. I, I wonder if we know about the same ones. Yeah, this is. I've got at least three for jackass. That's true. Box downstairs. Box downstairs. Oh, you don't know about box downstairs? <laughs> no. <laughs> box it was a great idea. He just got in a box. They tucked in some pillows around him, taped it up, rolled it down a huge flight of cement stairs, and it was violent as hell. There was also when Knoxville shot himself with the 38 caliber Smith & Wesson handgun. Oh yeah, and when he said, I'm Johnny Knoxville, and I'm gonna get hit by a car real soon. <laughs> yeah. Car just came flying, he went through the windshield, rolled over. They asked him, what were you thinking when you got hit by a car? And his answer was, I wore two pairs of jeans, so I'd be safe. <laughs> <laughs> this is gonna be a tough game today. Open yeah. books, Wee Man, Steve-O. <laughs> but hey, you know what? I'm hungry. <laughs> there he's diving in, diving in. <laughs> First For, one? Always the showman. I'll try the first one. So this wow. one's- I had a feeling it was gonna go this way. This one's way. the last dab. Mm -hmm. It's actually pretty hot. <laughs> 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 oh yeah. Jackass, it's long inspired its fair share of spin-offs. And I know that you are forever with your guy. So this might be a tough one to answer. Might be a wing. But I'd like you to rank these jack off. These <laughs> jack off? <laughs> you gotta rank some jacking off right now. Do you have I'd a like screen? You, I'd like you to rank <laughs> these jackass derivatives from best to worst. Bad Grandpa, The Dudesons, Nitro Circus, Wild Boys. I'll do it. Oof. Um, yeah, that is a little. <laughs> so, Bad Grandpa, The Dude Sins, Wild Boys and Nitro Circus. Yep. From bad? From best to worst. Oh, from best to worst? Wild Boys is best. <laughs> you. Thanks, bro. Yep. <clears throat> Even though we got paid a lot more from uh, Bad Grandpa. <laughs> <laughs> 
All right, and we'll we, do. And we'll, we weren't even in it. <laughs> <laughs> we'll do uh, bad grandpa next for us. <laughs> we'll be we'll be selfish on that, and then I'll go tied Nitro Circus and the Dutons for last. All right, Wee Man, here's a question for you that Kay. might also be tough to answer, because I know that you're a metalhead. Uh -huh. Forever into bands like Slayer, Black Sabbath, hardcore punk bands like the Circle Jerks. I'm curious, of the bands that you grew up listening to and yeah. idolizing, uh -huh. which one fell off the hardest and why? Oh. Remember when we went to go see Iron Maiden? Yeah, I've seen Iron Maiden a hundred times. Yeah, I mean, I'm not saying that they fell okay. off. No, they haven't fallen off. They, they Careful mean, around your eyes. Careful around your eyes. No, I know. Yeah. I'm doing it. That's why, that's why I back. ate with this hand, and I'm doing the back there. of this hand. Oof. Man, I've only done one, and I'm uh -huh. kind of dying. <laughs> I've done one bite, and I feel <sighs> good. I, I ate the whole thing. and yeah. it, You're gnarly. Um, <sighs> from all the bands, I will say this. Someone personally let me down when I met him, and I wasn't even, I, I knew of him, and he's he considered a rock guy, but I wasn't a fan. Kid Rock. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> he kooked out on me, I was like, huge kook. <laughs> All right, moving on here to the third round of uh, Truth and Dab today. <laughs> Steve-O Jackass, it's all about getting the best footage. If you get the footage, you get the most screen time. Yep. Is there a stunt or segment that was done by someone else that you're just insanely jealous of that yep. you didn't get to do it? Yeah, we make a valid point. Jackass is largely a battle of attention horse <laughs> <laughs> for screen time. <clears throat> uh, <laughs> I have one. It came real early on. It was the first movie. Uh, Manny came up to me and wanted to bite me in the nipple yeah. with the little mini alligator, and I was like, oh, hell no. And then he went up to Knox, did it, and it became Iconic. like poster, yep. gif, everything in the world. And I'm like, are you kidding me? <laughs> That's a good one. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I'm like, fuck. <laughs> that did make me wonder, of all the jackass castmates, who is the one person that is most likely to back out of a stunt at the midnight hour out of pure panic and alarm for what's about to go down? Uh, I think there's two. <laughs> and those two cast members are uh, Preston Lacey and Danger Aaron. We all put up a fight, but Aaron and Preston put up a pretty good fight. <laughs> <laughs> the only example I can think of where somebody really backed out at the last second was Dave England on The Riot Squad. He was just like, I'm too stressed out, I can't do it. And then it was just bam and done. Oh. He was lined up. You know, I know. wasn't there that day, yeah, so I, I know. didn't I see was it. Some sharks. Oh, that was crazy. <laughs> <laughs> well, this is just amazing, BTS. Off to the second to last round already, which is right, amazing. Yeah. <laughs> okay, I am hungry. <laughs> there we go, diving back in. That's, Evo, that's forever like the a couple showman. questions back. <laughs> 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 we man, from getting into a club, to scoring a quick payday, what's the most shameless way that you've leveraged Jackass's notoriety? <laughs> <laughs> um, damn. You don't no. drop your own name to get speed dialed in any situations? Uh, I'm, I, okay. <laughs> I, will, I will say this, this is a funny one. I was at a bar drinking Irish car bombs in the little bucket glass with the shot glass in them. And I had three chicks like fighting, like, no, I'm taking him home. No, I'm taking him home. No. And I was just having fun getting wasted. So I was like, ah. And I just started throwing the glasses <laughs> behind the bar. <laughs> Order another one. <laughs> so my buddy starts pulling me out of the bar. And the owner comes up and goes, What are you doing? And he goes, Dude, he's in five minutes, he'll probably destroy your bar. He's a liability. Yeah. And he goes, Don't care making the most money I've ever made tonight. He can stay and burn the whole building down. And my buddy's like, all right, he's your, he's your problem then. There you go. Man, I was in that same situation before Jackass, and I went to jail. <laughs> all right, well, we are on to the last round. And in the last round, we have a very special guest. Let's make this a hot sauce party. Yeah. Let's bring Jasper which, which way to the I table. Go? 
Come, come in, on in. Just, just come, come on straight in. through, Jasper. Okay. Just take it hey. in. What's yeah, up, guys? Nerds. We have Jasper in the building. It is a hot sauce party. He's, he's I don't know known. Jasper Dolphin is a very big celebrity, and he's a, also a new, new cast cat. member on Jackass. I'm a new yeah. guy. He's a new guy. He's it's a amazing. star of Jackass Forever. Woo! There's a dab. <laughs> oh my god, this is so terrifying. All right, to Jackass Forever, Jasper, Wee Man, Steve-O, to the people watching, it's going down. I can't right, wait. Mmm. <laughs> mmm. Mm. Doesn't... It just tastes like hot. <laughs> like it's hot. Whoa. <laughs> mm. well, that's Big, wait, was the prank on him? <laughs> the whole time. This this whole wave I have is a prank on me. <laughs> I, I fucked myself. I'm serious. Yeah. <laughs> I'm uh, serious. Oh. Diving off the deep end. Big. Carolina Reaper, got Apollo <laughs> pepper, basically a mix of the hottest peppers in the world, all having a party in my mouth right now. Dude, I took oh. one bite of the first one. <laughs> I took one bite of the first one. That one was like pretty good. I was busting my eyes starting to water. Yeah. This uh. one. Oh, it's <laughs> happening. Ah. I swear. I never had a wing this hot, I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> I thought it was like, oh, they're just overdoing it. It's not really that hot. It's that hot. Let me ask you a question, Jasper. You have seen these guys going through this show today, turning it into truth and dab. Is this more or less how you've come to know them? Are they more tame or are they less tame on the show today than from observing them on set? Honestly. Oh, it is kicking in. It's going in my nose now. I have now a good tear. It's in my nose, dude. I'm eating. Okay, now I can breathe fire. Can I be truthful with you? <laughs> yeah, yeah. I didn't hear a word you said because my mouth is on fire. Fuck. Those on the lines are, are they crazy? Too far, dude. We're filming. Dude, yeah. I'm eating the last ones to try to save me. Yes, 100 percent up and down. You guys are great. We all had a good time filming a movie. My first movie. Very happy, especially to do it with these type of people. <laughs> The naughtiest that we could find. These type of people. Yeah. The naughtiest. Little, little, little people. Oh, yeah. like, little, little people. The, these, yeah. the, and I get pointed at. Only oh, got you about two inches. <laughs> I'm not that tall. <laughs> well, Jasper. Jasper was awesome on set, dude. Yep. Yeah. You, you asked who would back out of a stunt, and the answer is not Jasper. <laughs> not oh, Jasper. Yeah. Never did. He I was down. Jasper was down on a level that made me uncomfortable. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> That is the highest of compliments coming from Steve-O. And speaking of down for whatever, coming in today, truth or dab, turning it in to truth and dab. Is there anything that you guys want to say to the people before we roll credits and get everyone to an ice bath? It's fire, dude. <laughs> it's fire. Only in theaters, October 22nd. They didn't give me no water or milk. <laughs> I didn't drink it. So that's all for you, bud. That's when I had milk, I yeah. threw up. <laughs> I, I'm finishing off the final dab for, uh, to save me <laughs> forever. The show to save you. To me down. <laughs> <laughs> that was awesome. <laughs> Did you snort it? Talk. No, no. Oh. I was just playing with the milk. I think it was gonna help, but like, I probably just look crazy now. It looks like an old man now. Your, your, your mustache went gray. Alright, now it's coming out my nose. Uh. <laughs> Can I get it? Oh, there we go. Good girl, Wendy. Oh. <laughs> <laughs>Hey, what's going on everybody? This is Sean Evans, and would you take a look at how we've set the table? Take a look at this. This is the Hot Ones Oxford Pennant Collab, a classic American company, Buffalo, New York in fact, shout out to Bill. These right here, they're perfect for the dorm room, they're perfect for the Hot Ones party that you're throwing at your place, perfect for the sports cave, to get yours, visit shop.firstwefeast.com. That's shop.firstwefeast.com to get your hands on the hot ones. Oxford pennant. Careful around the eyes. <laughs>